my Let's Play schedule on my channel swaps back over to Jack 2 here. From on this game, I left off when I was doing the uh, the mission of finishing up, uh, of doing the Hellcat Cruiser uh, hunting and, and all that, and that's all taken care of now. So it's now time to do Onan's next challenge, which is going to be the Brain Challenge by uh, getting the third uh, seal of Mar. Expecting that little boy to save us his folly. At his age, he's no match for the metalhead leader. Oh, Jack, we were just talking about Samos' plan. Onan says your voice sounds very familiar. I'll bet you two golden oldies go way, way back, huh? Onan needs you to prove yourself, Jack. You've shown your brass and your brawn. Now, you must show your brains as well. Frankly, I think she's pushing it. But I'm not the boss. Beat this test, and the third piece to receive will be revealed. Ready? Go! Come on, any more than the true number of each symbol will be penalized. Takes care of that, that required concentration. Behold, the seal of Mar is now complete. Onan says the three artifacts you retrieved from the mountain Dilbo are relics from an ancient light tower. Old songs tell how this light tower once shined down on the actual site of Mars tomb. I sing one of these songs for you. From the mists of time, Mars. He's terrible. Oh, there, Iron Man. Just tell us what we need to do. Cretans with no taste, huh? Look, you must take the three artifacts to Mars Gate. Only then will the light tower rise and reveal the tomb. I've got suspicious activity in this sector. <laughs> That may have been easier to do at first for the story, but when trying to do it after finishing the game, you actually have to get a thousand points, and all you get out of it is just three recursive orbs. And it is repeatable, but it's, it's too it's so very hard to try to reach the thousand points without using up all 20 misses. It gets much harder each round doing that challenge. So it's definitely no point in just showing it again when I finish the story. It's just showing this that same mini game again. And just for getting precursor orbs, that's definitely not really worth it at all for me. On the way to No Man's Canyon, the location of the light tower. 
The seal bar is used to open up the path that leads there. I'll find it's not worth it to try to go across with the jet board so I don't have to, you know, like take a death. I don't have to worry about taking damage here, it'll just go to the cuts. Or I can just save myself anyway, I guess. Consider that to be bad luck's payback for me performing perfectly on that challenge. Always happens to me every time. Oops, wrong way. This was the way to go back. Confusion hit me right there. Here is the, the, the way to go. There's the tower. Or just around the corner, anyway. There it is. Mars Tomb is officially uh, activated. the lens, and the gear, all used to activate the tower. It's now open. Actually, it was Owen in that uh, that founded, not uh, not Pecker. Owen's the one with the uh, with the uh, where to go. Pecker's just to be the interpreter. So it was Owen to thank for that. Yep, that skull that that skull thing on the map is the is the two. The room is not to be taken lightly, and I'm going to have to stop it before even reaching its, its close location. So that takes care of doing the brain challenge for Onan, and also activating the light tower that to open Mars Tomb, and Mars Tomb on part one will be next. Until then.